I would say that um, one of the most fascinating aspects of INKT is the potential for of the shelf use. So we can really manufacture INKT from any donor, we can expand them in the lab and we can store them as we would do with any drug really on the shelf. The reason is that compared to conventional T cells, INKT have a unique biology and they do not cause graft versus host disease. We call it also GBHD. This is a potentially lethal attack of the patients, recipients, healthy tissues by donor T cells because of their T cell receptor. Now, the T cell receptor in INKT is unique and because of that, they do not attack the healthy tissues. And this is why we can use them from any donor with a safer profile compared to conventional T. From a manufacturing point of view, that means that we can expand them without requiring further engineering to remove the endogenous T cell, which is uh, the T cell receptor, sorry, which is uh, obviously required also uh, for delivering their final uh, therapeutic effect. So the manufacturing can be streamlined, becomes easier and can be also cheaper, meaning that we can offer INKT cellular product to a broader patient population. But also what is important is that we've seen already dying patients because they don't have time because of their aggressive uh, cancer to wait for the manufacturing of their cellular product to be completed. So having a product already ready to go, ready to use on the shelf that they can receive at any point can offer them the opportunity to receive this potentially curative approach at any time, regardless of their uh, aggressive disease. So that's really fascinating, according to me. And also what is very fascinating is their uh, natural anti-cancer potential, which is perhaps a bit greater compared to other conventional T-cell therapies and then K therapy. And the reason is that INKT can reach some solid organs, for example, more easily compared to conventional T-cells. So they can see the tumor, they can find the tumor, but they can also find the suppressive microenvironment which is surrounding the tumor. So this is obviously leading to better responses and at the same time they can orchestrate a potent uh, immune response of the host immune cells against the tumor. And this is one of the important aspects that we also emphasized in our work presented at the tandem meetings, which is this ability to interact with the recipient immune cells and orchestrate immune responses that can be beneficial for the treatment of tumors.